There is new hope for people suffering from cystic fibrosis. It's a regimen of medications that some analysts say could be the event of the year in biotechnology. And some Wall Streeters say it could mean a tremendous boost for shareholders of drug maker Vertex. Meg Terrell has more now in this new treatment and what it could mean for the company behind it. Investing in biotech has always been risky, but there's an event coming up that analysts say tops all others this year. Vertex Pharmaceuticals is expected to report data soon on a combination of drugs for cystic fibrosis, a rare inherited disease that causes lung infections and other problems that can be fatal by age 40. Here's what you need to know about the program. Cystic fibrosis is caused by mutations to a gene known as CFTR. When the gene's defective, the protein it creates can't help chloride escape the cell. That hampers the movement of fluid across the cell wall and leads to the production of thick mucus in airways and other areas. The first medicine to address the genetic root of the disease was Kaleidico, which restores the protein's ability to allow chloride to pass through the cell's membrane. Only about 2,000 patients with CF have mutations that Kaleidico alone can currently help. Many more, though, have a bigger problem. The protein can't get to the membrane at all. So Vertex is testing another drug, Lumacaftor, which aims to help the protein get to the cell wall, where then Kaleidico enables it to open a passage for chloride. The combination of both drugs could help more than 14 times as many people. That bigger patient population also means bigger business, and positive data would be a huge driver for Vertex's stock. It's currently trading around $67, and analysts say positive results could drive the stock up past 100. A negative outcome could plunge it into the 40s. While cystic fibrosis affects few patients, Kaleidico, like other drugs for rare diseases, is priced at about $250,000 a year, and patients take the drug chronically. Kaleidico alone already draws $371 million in annual sales. Altogether, analysts estimate, if they work, Vertex's cystic fibrosis medicines could bring in more than $5 billion, not to mention the huge difference they could make for patients. For Nightly Business Report, I'm Meg Terrell.